Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Oh, hi friends, you're back. Me too. And I know what you're wondering. Why am I wearing a this? And why am I wearing goggles? It's because we're doing the science kit I got on Christmas. And and we are going to open it and see what's inside. Well, I've already opened it and I got the goggles, but I didn't really get to see everything else. And we're going to use that and make a science. I mean, make something exciting. I know I'm not talking right, but that means I'm so excited to do this. So let's head right in. If you haven't seen the science kit, this is what it looks like. It's called the Ra it's called Rainbow Lab. That's a weird name, probably because everything here is showing rainbow. But we're going to do a fun experiment, and let's head right in. Now I'll tell you what I got from the Rainbow Lab. So we got test tubes, measuring spoon, we have a stirring stick, a puppet, food color, we have potassium, we have stickers, notepad, we have these filter papers, we have some cups, we have a mixing tray, and we also have some goggles. And I think that's about it. Oh, almost forgot the rainbow glasses. And that's about it. First, I'm wearing my goggles. And now I'll tell you what I've done so far. So first, I fill the test tubes with some cold water. Halfway. As you can see, they're all halfway. And then I put one of the cup cups with water so then when I'm putting a different color in I can clean this up and then I can put a different color in and wash this up and all that so and then first we do red then yellow I mean then blue then yellow and five drops of each color and then so see this color mixer you have to put it on some paper so you can see your three colors a bit easier and then so that's how much I've done so far and now let's get into the video. Drops. We're just going to put a few more drops. 
the first color is kind of like a purple magenta kind of. It is very light purple. It didn't come as planned, but it's still a color. Um, a very light magenta purple kind of. It has a black line around it that is very odd, but that's fine. And this is the color we got. And now we're going to do yellow and red. Look at this, it's like a yellow orange. I've never seen this color before. Tell me in the comments if you know a fruit or something that looks like this color. It's like an, a yellowish orange kind of. And it has a red line around it. It's very nice. I didn't expect this color to come out. Um, it's very pretty, interesting. I wasn't expecting this much um color and beautifulness to come out but this is what i got now we're going to do blue and yellow first we take a little bit of blue put it over here one two three four we put the rest there we got the color out we take some yellow and we put one two three Drops. In. So I got a pretty green. Isn't that a beautiful light green? I didn't expect this beautiful color to come out of blue and yellow. Interesting. Oh, I'm mixing all three colors. Let's find out what it makes. First, I want to make it. Interesting. So first, I'm gonna add yellow. Take some yellow. Put it there. A few drops of the yellow. Put the rest there. Take the blue. A few drops. Looks like it's making the color we made before. And now we're gonna add the red. And see what it makes. Oh, well, you all know this color, that's for sure. If we just add a tiny bit of Take a little bit more red. Just drop a few more drops of red in there too. Oh, too much red. This this takes very much. It takes a lot of patience patience to make this. So. what I expected. You know the green we made before? It's like a darker version of it. Like a tiny bit light and it, it's like you know how brown is kind of mixed with green would be? This would it this is probably what it would be like a brownish green with a black line around it. Um, Very dark. Kind of looks like brown. When I first did it, I thought it was brown but then when I added a tiny bit more of yellow, it taught you to make greenish kind of look, a greenish kind of brown. So I'm very, um, I'm very shocked that it made this. Uh, I didn't know it, um, if you add three colors, it would make a color. I thought it would just make brown or something, but it actually made a very interesting color. Um, so yeah, and now we're gonna move on to the next step. So, since we made our color um, mixer and all that, we're going to do one with some potassium. 
and the stirring spoon and the measuring spoon. And we're going to use these three and and we're going to do and we're going to make color crystals with it. Here you go, you can see it. You can see the potassium and you can see our colors and our stirring spoon. You can see all of it. And now let's do it. So now we're going to take the potassium, take one spoon of it, and then pour it into this. Put the potassium in these three and put one tiny tablespoon. So first we'll do this one. There we go. Take another tablespoon. Oh, not enough. Is there? Oh, I think that's not enough. Two more. And there we go. The red one's already done, and I've now done the other two. Now, take it. I'm gonna add. Oh, not enough. One full spoon to all of them. Oops, these are very. They're not very. Easy. Okay, I'm gonna do the blue one one more time. One or two crystals, because it's not very really much. One more crystal for them. A few crystals. And then we do the other one. It's been a few minutes and look at these crystals. That one absorbed all the water and they feel so weird. Oh, they feel so weird. I don't know why, but they just do. And now, see these? So this one's grown, this one's grown, and this one. All of these little, all this potassium has grown into big, into big balls. I don't know why it made this, but it did. It's, it's so funny. <laughs> so see this? It's so tiny and smooth. And since there wasn't much water in this one, it absorbed all of it. It's supposed to absorb some, but it just absorbed all of it. And look at them. They're so cute and incy wincy. This green one too. It absorbed all the water. It's absorbing. These two have a lot of water, so it's absorbing a lot. But they're so cute and tiny. Don't you agree? Oh, I love them. I know we had only three colors to make the crystals and the color and the color, but we made all these colors. And look, they're so, so pretty. Aren't they? They became big, tiny crystals. And I think we have to let these three settle for night. So we're going to leave these for night and then on the next video I will show you this and then we will move on to what we are actually doing and I'm not telling you what we're doing, it's a surprise and I'll give you a little, a little tiny bit of help. It starts with the W so, so that's your little hint of what we're doing on the next video. And bye my dear friends, I hope you enjoyed this fun, exciting video and if you did, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and comment. Bye my dear friends.